So guys, welcome to another video. As will, anyway. So today we're gonna do a full gaming setup too. Nice. Stay tuned till the end of this video because I have a surprise for you. We're having a brand new giveaway coming up. Let's get it. We're gonna start off my chair. This is the autonomous uh, Ego Chair Pro. It's very comfy. It's about uh, $500. Uh, I think it's a little bit expensive, but it's worth it. I'm gonna continue to this corner and, I, and after I get to the main setup. So here I have some random shoes. I have my toolbox and here I uh, put my books for the school and some just random stuff. And here I built my uh, all my gaming PCs in this space here. Yeah, this is my uh, gaming ultra book. It's from XPG. It's the uh, XPG Xenia 14. It has um, i5 11th gen i believe with um, intel hd graphics and 16 gigabytes of ram 5 gigabytes storage i think yeah pretty good stuff um and here will be dusty anyways i have some you know random school stuff there's my screwdriver box and this is an organizer box i basically put all my screws my screwdrivers and just random stuff there that i need for building my pcs um g-shock some glasses rgb controllers um ac controller yeah moving on to my peripherals this is the genesis microphone 300 xlr it's a pretty solid microphone it comes with this uh um microphone arm whatever it is this and it is it to move it around good stuff so this is my mouse from logitech is the g502 hero uh, special edition white uh it, it's one of my favorite mouses it has uh, one two three four five six additional buttons you can use it while playing games and check this out look at that amazing anyways and also you can customize its weight you can put little weights here and make it heavier or lighter. Anyways, this is my mouse pad. It's from uh, Desk R. It's the white slash black uh, Canyon. It's one of my favorite mouse pads on the market. It costs around $30, I believe. I'm not sure. I will leave this link down below. And this is my keyboard. This is the GK61, I believe, or 62. I, I don't even remember. Uh, from Apple Maker keyboard with uh, this Aqua Gear uh, keycaps. It's also brown switch. And it's connected to my PC with this uh, coil cable from um, Yazi keyboard and it kind of matches the, uh, the whole theme uh, moving on this is my headset i have this headset for three years uh, they are from razer they are the razer nari essential it's my favorite headset and it's wireless also um, this is just a phone stand i normally put it around here while i am gaming so i have uh, i have fast access to my phone this is the gravastar venus speaker it's a very small speaker but it does a great job it's very loud has a very clear sound this is one of the best things on my setup let me open it so this is the divum d2 it, it's a bluetooth portable speaker you can play um games on it actually i'm gonna play lappy bird if i get up to 10 you have to like this video okay okay a few moments later six seven oh my god Shit. anyways please like the video Anyways, this is a PS4 light bar. I'm sure you've seen it in a lot of setups. It's just a great addition to every se gamer setup. And I just really love it. Good stuff, good stuff. I'm not going to my PC right now. I'll leave it uh, last, so stay in tune. And also, please like this video and stay till then because I have a surprise to you and a new giveaway. So yeah. Moving on to my monitors. This is uh, from AOC. It's 144 Hz, 1ms response time, I think. Yeah. And it's 24 inch. I have two of them. Uh, on a monitor dual arm from Arctic. Uh, I bought this from $60 uh, from a local gaming store. I also have some uh, lightning strips beho behind these monitors from Colorlight. So moving on to my wall, this is a Colorlight mix. They are smart luminance systems that could apply to multiple environments. I really love this. It kind of fulfills the wall with RGB as well. This Govic light wall light, as you can see it here. Um, it provides multiple lighting effects, a customizable layout and a slick finish at the end, as you can see. It's just awesome and good looking on my setup. And yeah, so moving on to my shelf, this is the uh, a frame with an iPhone X in it. It's from Grid Studio. Grid Studio makes crazy frames, including uh, Game Boys that I actually gave away one before. Uh, they make also frames with uh, smartwatches, Nintendos, and even uh, Nokia phones. It's just pretty awesome on your setup. And yeah, 
So this is the Devon Pixu Max, basically from the same brand as the D2. This is 32 by 32 uh, pixels, so you can draw uh, more things on this. And it does the same things as the D2, but you can play uh, music on this, but it's still a great product. Uh, anyways, these are my controllers. They are from AIM controllers. These are just kind of when RGB everything, as you can see, it's a PS4 controller or this is a PS5 controller. I made it black and white so it can match uh, the whole setup theme and I bought some cheap uh, controller stands from Amazon from $10 each I think. Anyways I'm sure you've seen this. These are some plants from Ikea. I bought these from uh, $1 each. They are they look pretty good on the shelf as well. So yeah moving on. These are the hexagon panels from Colorlight. They are pretty great. They look pretty awesome. So moving on to my desk. This is my desk it's from ikea it's the linmon two meters by 60 centimeters it's pretty big you can fit up to three monitors i believe and has much space and yeah so this is my pc as you can see here uh i have the ryzen 7 3700x paired with rtx 2060 as you can see here from asus uh we got 16 gigabytes of ram uh from v color the filter kit uh and look at those custom cables holy shit Shit. Okay, come. We have the 550 motherboard from Asus, the white edition, so it can match all the white slash black color scheme on the PC. This RGB backplate is from V1 Tech. They make great stuff. They also make AIO covers, as you can see. And for water cooling, we have the Lian Lee Galahad 360 millimeters, the white version. Uh, we got one and a half terabytes of storage with SSDs and one terabyte hard drive storage. So we got some SDIY white fans there, uh, Bit Phoenix white fans at the bottom, and at the top we have the radiator fans from Lian Li. I also have the O11 Dynamic Evo case from Lian Li. It's their newest case that they launched back in December, and I also have uh, the Montec power supply 850 watts. Uh, fully modular it's pretty awesome and i think i covered all the things before we get to the giveaway please like this video if you haven't already and subscribe anyways i partnered up with dutch tech nerd as you can see uh, on the screen for this giveaway click the link below on in my description and go to the giveaway post and follow the rules to join um or you can search me on instagram at daily g setups and you will find a post there i uh, will see See you in the next one. Peace. Yeah. yeah.